Hello, how are you? The title of today's video is GitHub Tutorial 12 Compare with Diff We are working on Git repositories. One of the frequent actions is likely to inspect the changes. You may want to find out the differences between your working directory and the staging area before you send git add command or between the staging area and the local repository before you send git commit command or between the local repository and the remote repository before you send git push command how can you achieve these goals or which git commands can be used to carry out the comparison task. For comparison between working directory and the staging area, you can use git diff command. If you know which specific file to compare, you may also append file name to this command. For comparison between the staging area and the local repository, you can use git diff command with option dash dash staged. For comparison between local repository and remote repository, you can use git diff command followed by local branch name like master and remote repository URL and branch name. For example, origin as default remote URL alias master as remote branch name by the way if you want to find out exactly what origin is pointing to use git command remote and the option V here is an overview of all three commands that we will use in the following demo First, let's take a look at how to compare the differences between working folder and the staging area. We are in master branch. List the files. We will work on demo01.txt file. Open it with notepad++. The original content is demo. We change it to test git div commands. Save the change. Send command div to see what happens. It shows staged file A has text demo while unstaged file in working folder has different text. Test git div commands. It works as expected. After we have known how to compare the differences between working folder and the staging area, suppose we decide to add the changes from working folder to staging area. Now we are more interested in comparing the differences between the staging area and the local repository. Let's continue our experiment. First, add the change to staging area. If we send git div command, we should see no difference or nothing returns. This is expected. It confirms that all the changes have been moved to staging area. Now add option staged to git div command. We will see that the file A in local repository still has text demo, but staged file B has a newly added text test git div commands. It works as well. Now the changes have been committed to local repository, 
before we move on to push them into remote repository, you may want to double check if the changes are expected. This is the final task we will do in this tutorial, comparing the differences between local repository and remote repository. As planned, send command commit with comment. Testing div commands. Now, if you send command git div staged, no difference is found since the changes have been transferred from staging area to local repository. The differences will show up when we compare local repository master branch with remote repository master branch. Here, origin is the alias of remote repository URL. The message shows that the local file A has a modified text while the remote file B has original text. Push the changes to the remote repository. Wait for the transaction to finish. Compare the difference again. Surely, we don't see any difference. Here is a summary of commands we have used in the above three scenarios. There are actually one git command diff with various options and parameters. What have been shown here are the basics of git comparison. If you need to know more details, or have a specific requirement for using diff, please refer to online git reference manual at git-scm.com. Thanks for watching.